It's called IntelliCheck. Partnering with them, you said they say you'll stand out with your competitors offering proven solutions. This is working for law enforcement, defensive transportation, all sorts of stuff. What is IntelliCheck? Brian Lewis is here to tell us all about it. Brian, give us the inside scoop there, my man. What are you talking about? IntelliCheck, we are an ID authentication company, and we can guarantee with greater than 99% certainty that an ID issued by the U.S. government, a military ID, or a state ID, driver's license, is authentic and real. Oh, that's good news. Yes. This is something I think that uh, we've all been looking forward to with all the ID stuff that's been stolen now, and, and how does this all work? It's really very simple. So you hit the nail on the head. We're used mostly in two areas, uh, identity theft, so people keeping crooks from stealing your identity to get credit in your name, and then also in age-restricted products, so alcohol, tobacco, and cannabis. And it's very simple. All somebody needs to do, say a bar owner wants to make sure people are legitimate, uh, they download an app on their smartphone, they scan the back of the ID, and we authenticate it. And I think that's a big point of differentiation. The crooks know how to create a barcode on the back of an ID mm -hmm. that will pass a simple scanning test. They advertise it. But I can tell you that in Georgia in 2018, one in four out of all the IDs scanned by our clients turned out to be fraudulent. And no these IDs are cheap. You get three of your friends together, you can go online and buy a Georgia driver's license with any age you want for $60. Gee whiz. How, and how do parents uh, uh, and others uh, go about checking this out or, or getting your service? It's real simple. You know, you just go to IntelliCheck.com um, and you, know, you can uh, download the app. We make it very affordable, especially for law enforcement. We're used by over 55 law enforcement agencies across the country to, you know, help uh, keep age-restricted products out of the hands of children. Because it is pretty much, you know, an epidemic. You know, 11% of all the alcohol consumed in the United States is consumed by kids aged 12 to 20. And then 90% of that is binge drinking, which I think you, oh. know, you all see uh, during spring break down there. Mm -hmm. You know, 75% of college men admit to getting drunk on a daily basis when they're on spring break. That's pathetic. And, of course, we just had the same big – we have a big St. Patrick's Day celebration here, Brian. And, and, and uh, yep. you know, I'd like to have I'd like to have the money that the, 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 the party goers spill here. <laughs> it's less. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that's a lot of beer on the street. <laughs> you say that about – I went to Ole Miss, and you say that about our – you know, what happened during football season with our with our students. Uh, and yeah. spell, spell IntelliCheck for me, please. I N. T-E-L-L-I-C-H-E-C-K. And, and this sounds like something that would be perfect for, you know, getting a handle on this uh, ID theft and, and fraudulent, uh, fraudulent, uh, fraud, uh, all, okay, what am I trying to say? Fra fraudulent <laughs> activity, fraudulent activities all together. I'm, I'm a professional, Brian, that's the difference. Yeah. Um, so that just, yeah. Sound, that sound, just sounds like the answer to a lot of problems here. Yeah, we're used by uh, four out of the top five or top ten credit card issuers in the nation to make sure that nobody is using your identity to get credit in your name. As I said, we're used by 55 law enforcement agencies and you know thousands of bars uh, across the country. Who you know the bar owner knows that they need to go beyond what the law requires. Because the unfortunate thing is the law just says that you need to do a visual inspection of a license. The problem is these fakes have all the holograms. Um, they advertise as soon as a new version of the license comes out. Uh, they've got it. In, you know, in 2018, uh, South Carolina came out with a new license. And these guys were advertising probably a month later that they had the brand new 2018 uh, license template. Yeah. So they're good, and you know, this is what I say to people too, especially in spring break and bar communities. Um, you know, I live in New Jersey. I couldn't really tell you what a Pennsylvania driver's license looks like, and that's the next state over from me. Yeah. So the visual inspection just does not work. You need to use technology 
because the bad guys are using technology to their advantage, and our laws just haven't kept up. And Brian, are, are there actually uh, the, the bad guys are actually advertising this? Hey, we got the news. Oh, there the news. are multiple, multiple websites that you can go to, um, and you can price shop, comparison shop, um, and like I said, they're all cheap. You know, I just looked at the states. You know, kind of around Georgia. Uh, you get three of your friends, you can get Florida licenses for $40 each. And they always give you two in case somehow you lose one. Uh, <laughs> Alabama, $60. As I said, Georgia, um, $60. The new South Carolina, because it's so new, a little bit more expensive, that uh -huh. one's $100. But it gives you an idea of the ballpark of this. And, you know, if you're going, if you're going to college, it seems to be, you know, just as surely as you're buying your new textbooks, you're getting together with your friends and you're buying a fake ID. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Telecheck. That's Brian Lewis. Uh, good, good service. Half past eight.